What's up, guys? It's your boy John. We're back. Woo! What's up guys, it's your boy John. We're back again here with another video. Today we have a Model Y. Now this Model Y is beautiful, nice white color, but these caps, they're pretty ugly. So I got some EV base aero caps right here. I'm gonna be able to show you guys off. Real nice here. This is gonna have a little center cap that I believe is in there too. Let me just pull this out. Look at this design. It looks like, kind of like the induction wheels, which, I really, I'm a huge fan of. And it's packaged really nice. And here are the little caps right here that goes over it. So these do not show any kind of Tesla logo or anything like that. So you can put a decal on there if you want. Let's check out this design a little bit more. Woo! So this, I know it's red, but the cap would go there. Let me demonstrate that. Beautiful. Of course, you take off the red backing, but it'll go something like that. Wow, this looks so beautiful. Now, let me open all of them because there is a certain direction, whether it's like this or like this. So imagine like this and your car is spinning like this. It's cutting through from here. But if you go right like this, the, the, the veins are facing the other way and it's cutting like that. So I'm gonna see if these are directional. And there's also a little adhesive. I don't know if you guys saw that. If you want to protect the wheel, you can put these this little foam pad around this. That way it will prevent some rattles uh, if you have any. Generally, these clips alone are good enough for me. So if you look at these ones right here, they all point the same way. So they're they're not directional. What that means is if you see, I have a Model Y right here too. The induction wheels, they are not directional too, so they're all the same size. The other EV base aero caps that I have are directional, so they always look like they're spinning forward. All right, let's go check it out right here. So to remove these, it's pretty easy. You just grab it, notice where the valve stem is, and you pull. Now you have to pull pretty hard, but once you pull, it will, show this beautiful face. I am gonna quickly take this off right here. This beautiful piece. This really helps lock it in. This is why I like EV Base. They have this nice mechanism that really clamps into that. Sticker on sticker. Interesting, right? I kind of like the no logo look. If you want to have your own little branding, you can put it in there. Now, to match it up here, you want to look at this little cutout right here. So this is where your valve stem would go. And line it up. And you just It's that easy. Oh, pop, pop. make sure you're popping real good. Let's see if it rattles at all. I'm, I'm shaking it. It is clamped on real good. And real. Check that out. Comparison between the back wheels and the front wheels. It looks stunning. What do you think, cameraman? Uh, it's definitely a big improvement. I know a lot of people don't like these base model induction. If you, if you just step back a little bit, you can get the whole, the whole look. So this kind of, there's so many blades, it almost looks like a flower. It looks like a turbine, but more flowery. That's beautiful. So I'm gonna do the, this, this one as well, real quick. Same process. Oh, <laughs> oh, so again, they're clipped on pretty good, so they're not going anywhere. Remove this back yeah. foam. 
So there you guys have it. Woo. I think it's a big addition. The reason why I like these over the other ones I had initially is because they cover more of the wheel. Now the Model 3, the wheels are already dark. The Model Y now is silver. So the more it covers the face, the less you see of the silver wheel on the back. So if you look really close, you can see the barrel of the wheel and it's silver. And this is why I like this one or the other Ninja Star one. You can really see the silver and that kind of distracts it. Let's look at the other side. And this is the silver side, yeah. So we already removed the hubcaps on these. These look great, to be honest, but the lack of lug nuts and the center caps and also the degrade in range, it's just not worth it. So that kind of concludes it. If you guys were interested in this product, I will have a link down below. We're giving out a discount. Use the code John15 and you can get 15% off. And it also gives me a kickback from the affiliates. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next one from Tesla videos. Peace. What do you think of the wheels, kids? This is so cool. Would you give it a 10 out of 10? For sure.